Hey guys, it's Sanwonane and welcome to Alien Difference Entertainment. If you are new to this channel, thank you so much for coming through. And to those that has been with us since the start and those that has just recently joined us, thank you so much for your love and supporting in Tandanonke. So two shows from Durban, namely Durban Jen and Uzala, which are based in Guazulu Natal in the CBD of Durban. That is where their studios are situated. They had to halt uh, the production because of what has been happening in guazulu natal especially even though it has been happening also in parts of Gauteng, but guazulu natal has been the most hit uh, by this uh, storm that has been happening of looting and some violence so they said they have to take some extreme measures in order to protect their cast members so they allegedly spoke to or rather some cast or actors spoke to Daily Sun allegedly and this is what they had to say. Devin Jen actors said Guti people looted a game that is next to our studios on a Tuesday and that's a scary. We can't risk our lives by going to work. They also burnt the nearby building. It's hard. And the publication goes on to allege Guti they spoke to Uzalo actors and some of them had this to say. We are still going to starve. This is madness. We just pray that our shooting studios won't be set alight as many buildings are on fire. Life is hard and by the looks of things it's going to get harder. Let's pray for Umzanzi. And indeed, it is going to be hard, especially for those other people that at least Bebe Seven Zabona. So now they find themselves unemployed in these days. And also, not just that, but it is said people had to make long lines, snake lines, uh, in order to get into retails and buy the essentials that they need. And indeed, they are going to run out because uh, the shopping centers they have been burnt. It is alleged to there are more than 200 shopping centers both in KZN and Guazuru Natal that has been looted and burnt. And yes, it is not all the shopping centers that were looted and burnt down, but some of them were burnt after being looted. And really, honestly, it is about to really hit hard and into reality to those, those, to those people that has done such a thing deeds because honestly they will not survive on those things that that they have looted for a long run it is just a short term thing and they're gonna come to a hard realization and it will be hard to reverse or rather they cannot reverse what has happened and what they have done they're just gonna have to live with that because this will affect abantuana bay to see song even though we were not involved some of us or rather a majority of the people of South Africa. So like, really, I'm just like, it's just devastating, honestly, because Gunzim and Iksazu Banzima Gwangambela. So go ahead and comment it down below in the comment section and let me know what is your thoughts on what has been happening in our country for the past week and uh, like really it is heartbreaking so comment down below in the comment section don't forget to like the video share out the video and subscribe if you have not yet done so thank you so much for watching this video do take care